What's going on, everybody? Welcome to GMI's World. And as you can see right there in the lower left, the team of the week players are out for week two. Now, you got Travis Kelsey as a master on offense and Bobby Wagner as, a, as the master on defense. But we're going to go ahead and check out, like we usually do weekly, the players that consist of making those uh, masters. So let's go see if EA Sports got it right this week. We're going to go over here to week two. Uh, we're going to do offense first. Obviously, Travis Kelsey was a monster. We don't need to really talk about that. The dude has been a beast. Um, he was good in the win when they had it against the Patriots in week one. He was also very, very good um, uh, th this past Sunday. So let's go ahead and look at the cards that make him up. Now, if you had Michael Crabtree against the Jets, you are smiling heavily right now as you look at this because a lot of people made money and a lot of people lost a lot of money. When we look at his card, though, um, you know, for the price, I'm not sure you want to spend that. He's pretty much like an Amari Cooper. You know what I'm saying? But more of an upgraded version of Amari Cooper. I'm just going like by the speed. Obviously, the other things that he does, like the catch and traffic and the jump and all that stuff like that, the route. Uh, route actually is probably something that matters more. The release, they all seem to do like the same things with the 80s, like for my 80 receivers. I haven't really got my hands on a 90, rece uh, 90 release receiver yet. But as far as the 80s go, they usually, you know, for some, some parts, they'll just beat them off the snap and just go. Um, he's lacking a little bit of elusiveness, but that catch rating of 86 doesn't really excite me because, you know, a lot of a lot of my other guys, like Randy Moss, he drops the ball wide open. So I'm not really interested in that, but he's sort of like a, you know, a high, high budget Amari Cooper. You know, would I get him? Nah. You know what I'm saying? If I pull him in a pack, I'll sell him without even thinking about it. Uh, let's just be honest about it. Uh, first of all, let me go over here and JJ Nelson. Let's see what his speed is looking like. What do they got? Because that's pretty much all you would need J.J. Nelson for, 91. So he's similar to um, the other guy that I have on my team, uh, Tyreek Hill. So that works there. Uh, we have Jason Fowler, you know, the fullback of the Titans. He was pretty well. I don't know what he's going for, though. Um, I wouldn't put too much into this either. Yeah, because what is his run block looking like? How much is uh, uh, 80 run block? So let me compare him. What is he, like a 73, the other one? Where's the run block at? Uh, run block, 73. Yeah, so they gave him, oh, plus 7. That's actually huge. EA doesn't really hand out a lot of plus sevens in the truck with plus five. That's not bad. That's not bad right there. If you're looking for a fullback, okay, I, yeah, that guy, he's highly recommended right there. Uh, 80, 80 run block is not bad. Right guards, like I told you before, the right guards, any lineman, what you're looking for, impact block, and then secondary run block, pass block, whatever like that. Impact block, he's at 80. He's at the bare minimum. I wouldn't recommend this guy because I, I like him at least 83, 84, you know what I'm saying, and above. Run block and pass block look solid. He's okay if you could get him for cheap, but I wouldn't chase him. Um, Trevor Simeon was really a stud this week, man. Uh, he really embarrassed the Cowboys. Wow, he's that cheap, huh? Uh, guess, yeah, 80 throw power. Okay, I can see that. And those are some really, really bad stats. He actually didn't look anything like the way that card, like the way he's described in that card. He looked really, really good for the most part against that Cowboys defense. He did make bad decisions that the Cowboys just couldn't capitalize on, but yeah, I think he was better. Benjamin Watson, I'm not even going to check that card. I wouldn't recommend. With these 70s, if you get them, just sell them. J.J. Nelson, he probably would be good for kick returning, but that's it. I would sell everything else, all right? Unless you, you really want to get Kelsey and you're trying to get everything else together for him, I would just sell the other things. You know what I'm saying? Travis Kelsey is definitely looking like a goon right now. Okay, Bobby Wagner. Let's look at some of the – he was really, really a good – you know, he was a stud. They struggled against the 49ers, but the Seattle Seahawks defense was pretty good. We have to give him credit for that. Chris Jones coming in as an 89 overall. All right. This right here, you know what I'm saying? I, I, you know, they, they're giving Kansas City love, but hmm, I don't see no Kareem Hunt. Where's Kareem Hunt at? You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm looking for – like, I don't even really care what this guy's stats are. How strong is he? 87 strength. He's not even dealing with my main man, Miles Garrett, that's coming in at a 91. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not even really interested with this guy. I have no – look, I'm not even going to – look, man. Wh wh where is Kareem – is Kareem Hunt – like, bro, that's what I'm looking for. That dude is just straight balling. Desmond Trufant played well, but I'm pretty sure his price is way too hefty as an 87. Yeah, I, I wouldn't spend this. How fast is he, though? 88 speed? No, I wouldn't spend it on that. No, I wouldn't spend that. Um, Lattimore with a 90 speed. Uh, he's a lower overall, but I would, I would rather get that over, you know, whatever. McKinney, he played pretty well, but I'm not really interested in that card. McCourty, no thank you. Uh, Devondre Campbell, no thank you. All right, so these guys, again, when they're in the 70s, you only get in them to sell them back real quick, or unless you want to complete the set for Bobby Wagner, you go ahead and do it like that. But these defensive standouts, none of them really do anything for me um, at all, except for the master, which is Bobby Wagner, which means I'd have to go through all of these things to, to unlock 
Bobby Wagner and uh, Travis Kelsey. So that's pretty much where we are for Team of the Week. Let me know the players that you're interested in uh, in getting and, you know, drop a line there. Let me know how you're going about getting it. Let's talk about it and see if I should get one of these guys. But I'm not really interested, man. Um, that's Week 2 for Team of the Week. And that's how you unlock Travis Kelsey and Bobby Wagner. There it is for you, man. Make sure you share the vid. Subscribe. Look out for some YouTube streams coming soon. See you guys and girls next time. One love.